has been another busy week here in the Chloe Dome. I have been picking up some sets, some slabs, and I've even had someone who has painted some incredible Pokemon canvases, and I'm actually going to give one of them away to you guys. So let's take a look and see what my most recent pickups are this week. So we are back again with some binders, and I've actually got four binders here, some incredible cards. So we're going to go ahead and take a look and see what's in the first one. We're starting off with a favorite here. We have got a little base set binder going on. I'm going to show you everything that's inside. Um, so these binders all came from the same person, but this week I have done multiple pickups from multiple different people. Um, like I said, we got those binders, we got some slabs. Um, I did pick up another near complete set as well of, a, of something else, which I won't share too early because that's fairly exciting. We'll take a look at that in a little bit. So as we can see, we just got a little base set binder here um, and I'm loving all these pickups that we're getting recently. Um, I'm starting to get more and more in, so I'm going to show you as much as I can every single time. Um, I didn't have to travel to pick these ones up. These all came to me, um, whereas sometimes I go in person and pick collections up. But for this one, this got posted. So that was the base binder. Now I've got binder number two, and we have got unlimited gym challenge in here. Giovanni's Persian, beautiful card. We got Blaine's Charizard up there. Brock's Ninetales actually has a really nice swirl. So as we're going through, guys, always let me know what your favorite part of my collection pickups are from this week. Um, Rocket's Mewtwo looking nice, trying to look out for some of those hashtag swirls get girls. I think we got one there on Sabrina's Alakazam. Um, so again, this is... Oh, gym challenge in here. Really nice Sabrina's Gengar artwork. Like I said, I've been picking up some really, really incredible sets recently. Raw cards, um, slabs. We have got a few slabs in this one. And you may be seeing these, or a few of these, on my Whatnot. So I'm going to be streaming on Whatnot twice a week. That doesn't affect my YouTube streaming at all. So don't worry. We're going to be here opening packs for as long as I can open Pokemon packs for. Um, but I will be on Whatnot now twice a week. So selling things that I wouldn't be doing on YouTube. So we're talking slabs, singles, um, all sorts of exciting stuff. So that was Gym Challenge. Now, binder number three contains a set that I would love to box break one day. Haven't had the chance to yet, but we have got base set two in here. Now, I feel like base set two is a bit of a controversial one. Not everyone loves it, but I personally love that hollow pattern on base two. Just look at the swirl on that Clefable. I'd love to do a base two break one day for you guys. Haven't managed to find a box yet to do that for you, but when I do, um, you will be the first to know about it, and we'll be doing a base two break here on the channel. As always, guys, and this kind of strays away a little bit from the collection, but while we're looking at these cards, let me know in the comments. I want to hear your suggestions all the time. What do you want us to do next on the channel? I want to keep making things more exciting, bigger and better. Let me know some big boxes, within reason, that we can open. Nothing too wild, but something exciting that we maybe haven't done before. So this is all base two in here. And like like I said, one day we will be lucky enough to open this set on the channel. So this is quite a cool pickup. Like I said, I absolutely love base two. So I'm pretty sure it's all just base two in the binder. I don't think there's any hidden surprises in the back. So let's take a look at binder number four. Now binder number four is a biggie. So I hope you're ready for this guys. We have got Aquapolis. Oh my goodness. We love E-series here on the channel and being able to pick up a set of Aquapolis. I mean, Incredible. So we're going to take a look at all of these beautiful cards. Obviously love Blissey. I know I'm biased. Beautiful Espeon down there. Really, really popular card. Let me know out of every card in Aquapolis, what's your favorite artwork? Love the Houndoom there. Did I just see a huge swell on the Executor? I think I did. Um, yeah, never ever get bored of E-Series. That Nine Tails. Doing an E-Series break is one day the ultimate dream. Whether it will happen... I do not know that Umbreon and Tyranitar as well. Oh my goodness. Um, yeah, not sure if it will ever happen, but if we're lucky enough to do it, we will definitely do it and it will be here on the channel. I always joke about doing 
a triple box break that's all three E-Series boxes, Sky Ridge, Aquapolis and Expedition Base set. I mean, I think I'm dreaming. Maybe if we win the lottery, but we shall see. There's some really, really funky artworks right here. Chancy, chancy. Let me know what your favorite is down below. What do you think of this first section of the pickup video as well, guys? Because this is just one of the pickups I have made. Like I said, these four binders that you're seeing first all came from the same person. Um, and we picked up some other stuff from a few other people this week. It's been a busy week here in the Chloe Dome. So, oh my goodness, what a binder that is. Let's take a look at some of the other bits I picked up. Okay, next up, before I go any further, I actually just want to show you guys some of these PSA returns. These are some of the WWE cards I sent off. Now, if there's any WWE fans, let me know what you think of these. I've got them proudly displayed on the backdrop there. A little bit bummed that that got an 8, but I think it's got a really dented corner. But yeah, I thought that was cool. So anyway, while we're on the subject of slabs, I picked up three gold star dogs this week. We're starting off with the Raikou gold star here in a Beckett 9. Now... As you know, if you've watched the channel for quite a while, I'm not a huge Beckett slab collector, but these came up and I couldn't turn them down. Absolutely beautiful. So we got the Raikou. We have then got the Suicune Gold Star here, also in a Beckett 9, guys. Let me know what you think of these. I actually think they look really, really good in the Beckett slabs. And I think we got a bit of a swell going on there under Suicune. And obviously we got Entei also in a Beckett 9. So the trio there of gold stars all in Beckett 9 slabs. And just as I'm filming this video, this has literally arrived through the door. A first edition gym challenge art set. Now, one of my lovely subscribers is the most incredible artist and has painted me some canvases. Actually, that Charizard canvas up there, don't mind the hole in the wall, is also from Andy. Um, and Andy sent me some more artwork in. So, as we can see here, we got the Luigi Pikachu kind of fits well because there it is the mario pika boxes in the background this one is actually going to be going on my studio wall he also painted me the mario pikachu guys i cannot explain i feel like the camera's not doing it justice these look absolutely insane in person this one is also going to be going on the studio wall and then andy gave me some to give away so i've already given away the dragonite canvas that he painted but we've also got this special delivery zard just look how insane is this like i'm seriously Honestly, I am super, super grateful. And can we have massive love for Andy down in the comments? Because this is so, so kind. So this video's giveaway is going to be this Charizard canvas that you see here. All you've got to do is comment down below, subscribe to the channel, and you'll be in for a chance of winning this. Oh no, we've just had Pika fall off, but it's okay. Um, one of you guys will be in for the chance of winning this incredible canvas painted by Andy. Thank you again. And guys, just look at it insane and now we have got a near complete expedition set here keep your eyes peeled like i said some of this will be coming up on my whatnot so make sure you're following me on there pokey chloe the link is in the description below so there we go we have got some beautiful cards in here i have got the condition written on most of these ones as well as we're going through you will see the blastoise a beauty butterfree it looking nice as well the incredible charizard there i mean just gonna give you guys a close-up on that one Dragonite as well as we're going through these as always let me know down below what your favorites are I mean we got Fero doubling up there for Ralligator love that artwork looks so so nice the Gengar oh my goodness what a beautiful card and then going all the way through just going to give you guys a little shuffle through so like i said this week we've picked up a real real variation of things we love the mew from expedition one of the fan favorites a beautiful beautiful card and the mew too as well just look at that swirl that looks incredible um so yeah we've picked up some incredible things this week singles sets slabs those canvases guys do remember to comment down below because one of you lucky people is going to be winning that charizard canvas look at the swirl on that skarmory right there tyranitar very nice um and let me know what you think are you enjoying these collection pickup videos there's going to be a lot more coming because i got a lot more cool things in the works so make sure you got the notification bell on blossom with the swell make sure you've liked the video guys and we're ending with the mother of all swells there with octillery i'll see you again next time